And a few of the parents asked me that, how do we explain what's going on in Gaza to our children? Now, I have a question for you, but raise your hands, okay? So why, do, why did Allah create us? Someone said to worship him, okay? Okay, you're going to say that. Any other reason to follow the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam? Good. Also, Allah Subh'anaHu Wa Taala created us as a test. Because what happens after this life? There's the next life. Yes. And what happens in the next life? Yes. So where are you alive forever? The Jannah or Jahannam, right? After this life, there's the day of judgment. And there's the day of judgment. The people who believed and did good, where do they go? They go to Jannah, right? So this life is a test, right? This life is a test. And in this test, good things happen and also bad things happen. Why? Why do bad things happen? Because it's a test from Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, right? That's why Allah created it. Do you, has it, do you ever get sick? Is it fun to get sick? No. What are other bad things that happen sometimes? Have you ever broken anything? An arm, a toe, finger. Yeah, it sprained your ankle. I stepped on it yesterday as well. You sprained your wrist, right? People get sick. During COVID, so many people are getting sick and all these things. Now, all these are tests from Allah. And what do we do as believers? How do we, what do we do to, as, as Muslims with tests? Yeah, we try to be good people in tests. How are we good in tests? Yeah, we recite the Quran. But when things are difficult, what do we do? We are patient and we're patient. And we know that if we are patient and act in a good way, we have reward from Allah. Right? We have reward from Allah. So when dif difficult things happen, we know that this is a test from Allah. And then what happens if someone dies in a test? You go to Jannah. Yeah, you go to Jannah, right? So for example, if, you know, we may hear that, oh, there was these bombs thrown and little kids died. Do we, don't we feel sad? Yes, but what do we know? Yeah, they're martyred. Very good. Right? They were martyred. Right? If they, if the test comes and someone sees that this is a test from Allah, and they're patient, they have sabr. Where do they go? They go to Jannah, right? They go to Jannah. So we know that, right? That we are created in this life to worship Allah, to believe in Allah. And Allah will send us tests. And in the tests, we have to be patient, right? We have to be patient. And if we're patient, we have reward in the akhirah. But also, if we see other people who have tests, what do we do for them? Do we only feel sad? We make dua for them. Right? We make dua for them. We tell people about it, that you should, in charity, we encourage our parents, that mom, dad, could we give some money for the people of Gaza, for example? Or could we give some money to, you hear that there's peop, there are these people who don't have water. Okay, can we help? Build a well. So that's how we see the tests. Right? This is how we see the tests. The tests are from Allah to see how we respond to the tests. And if we respond in a good way, we have the pleasure of Allah and reward forever and ever and ever. There, yeah, hasanat. Very good. You should be giving the class today. He's even got a desk in front of him. Same color as my desk. Alhamdulillah. لا إله إلا الله محمد رسول الله